good day, sir. Yeah, good afternoon. How are you? Fine, thank you. So, um, please, I have a question for you. Go ahead, please. Um, what is your opinion on full scarcity in Nigeria? You see, before I abscatulate, let me abruptly regurgitate my point of view vis-a-vis -vis fuel scarcity. Using my perspicacity and ratiocinations as a compost mentis homo sapiens and as an erudite and academic juggernaut, <laughs> let me delineate the nitty-gritty, the nuts and bolts, and the crinkum crankum of the status quo. Now this will be the exam. You see, this is not me venting out my garrulity and loquacious monomania in this tête à tête. You see, I would never intentionally obfuscate, befuddle, becloud and bonfuzzle Nigerians in a fog and canopy of obnubilation and agobago malaki. <laughs> now let me digress to the crux and focal point of this colloquy. It is dismally lugubrious and doloriously lacrimose that the premium moto spirit or if you have the proclivity and propensity to refer to it with the layman's nomenclature, which is fuel, is no more ubiquitous. <laughs> and concomitant to that, the price keeps burgeoning and mushrooming as a corollary to the scarcity. Just, just, just <laughs> now let me demystify and delineate as I pilot and paddle you through this expository legato peregrination of rebabative rig maro. Is he why the craze? You see, the government have prefabricated, galvanized, and plummeted the economy into a gargantuan, cataclysmic hibernation. What is the meaning of this? Some monolence and discombobulated economic hamatan that has consequently culminated and cacatavated into a cantacrous and nefarious ruckus. If I decide to release this vertical woman, the only way to vanquish this elephantine, gargantuan quandary is to deracinate and obliterate the malfeasant, shonky, and mendacious scully gusters and substitute them with dinkum compost mentis homo sapiens. Thank you. All the French, uh, Germany, Greek, and all these things that you speak, plus your exposure and educational background, I wonder why you have not made it in life. <laughs>